This game would this game would literally slap in 2021. This is Battlefield New Heroes Battlefield Heroes ex trailer extended. This is from like bloody what is this? 2009. 2009 this came out, this trailer. I mean like fuck man. Look at this shit. I don't even think it's funny. 720p was the highest they could pump out back then. Yeah. Look at this shit. Yes, it's said in the old World War II era. Yes. You just update this, make it, make it like. Gameplay over graphics, man. This would slap today. And it had like customizable skins. It had like decent gameplay. Good emotes. It's basically like cartoony Battlefield. Like, come on, man. You can't tell me that this wouldn't slap today, man. Good. Look at this. Jeez, at least in this game you could figure out who's on what side, right? Holy shit. Jesus Christ, man. Like, is this, is this gonna be the same fucking one? No, this is Dice. This is Dice's thing. Man. Dice. Yep. Look at this shit. I still remember that. Bro, day. this game is so fucking good, man. The sound of the waves on the beach, the drone of the bombers overhead. I remember thinking that the world would never be. Because you set the again. pace with uh, extra content, that's have to all be in game. That day. You don't have to attend a fucking concert tougher. in a game, dude. We became men. We became. Heroes. Sorry about that. Wrong trailer. Bro, this is so good. So fucking good, man. In the daytime, I'm just oh, wow. a regular lead designer. But at night, I become Corporal Tommy Chester, commando in the Royal Army. In the daytime, I have no idea why they closed this down. This game was this game would be ready for 2021. I become Heinrich von Schnitzel, Commandant in the National Army. You know what you do? I fix this game for them. You release it on consoles, you release it on fucking Switch, you release it on phones, and you make it free to play, and holy fucking shit, EA, give me 5% of the cut of this game, because literally all you need to do is just port that shit. It used to run in fucking Java. Java? Wasn't it running in Java? Java back in the day? You literally could just do, do this game, and you would make, you'd make money, man. And it's, it's free money, man. It's free money. I'd play this game, bro. All the memes and shit that come out of this. Battle right. Battlefield Heroes is a download for free, play for free, cartoon shooter. To play the game- Oh wait, it already was free? Oh. But you shut the whole service down. Why? You visit the Battlefield no Heroes website money. and hit the big button that says, play now. <laughs> That's right. You don't visit a store, you don't enter your credit card details, and you don't download it on BitTorrent. It's free. Battlefield Heroes oh, is shit. a cartoon shooter. This is a type of shooter that focuses on fun, accessibility, and not getting shot in the face repeatedly by a swearing, ultra-skilled 15-year-old boy who plays the game every day for eight hours. The gameplay focuses on things like shooting the bad guys, using your special abilities, and running over people with a huge cartoon tank. Wait, 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 wait. Using special abilities? You had, had, had ability-based games back then? Matchmaking means you'll only play against people of your skill level, and you'll keep coming back for more because we feel matchmaking please on the website with a long running territorial conflict meta game and a full leveling up and customizable character system territorial overblade game like new world back then guys it's, it's we need this game we need this here. game back come on year, and it's going to win the war soldier bro <laughs> They did Wake Island in this too, didn't they, one stage? This is fucking awesome, man. I would play the fuck out of this game, man. Fuck out of this game, dude. Bruh. 
Is it even a website? Battlefield-Heroes.com. Battlefield-Heroes.com. Give me one minute, one minute, boys. One, one, one minute, one minute, one minute. They probably own it. What do I need to go grab it and snap it up? It doesn't go anywhere. Imagine Fortnite without building or loot. That's exactly what this game is. And plus vehicles. I mean, Fortnite has vehicles now. It's fucking crazy, man. Fucking crazy. Oh, there's a project for this? Rising Hub? Hello? Oh, we probably shouldn't be. I don't know if this has got the... But that's cool, though. They got servers. EA, just take this shit back. Oh, there's one in Sydney, but there's only one person playing. There's no, there's no, there's no one playing. Oh man, that sucks balls, dude. There's no one on these servers, bro. No one, no one. There's some people playing in fucking Germany. Ah, oh, that sucks, dude. That'd be so sick. I'm back and heard the Battlefield Heroes theme. Yeah, BJ. <laughs> this game is Battlefield Heroes, man. It was ready to go years ago. Years ago. Yet. Like they did seasonal events? Are you freaking serious, man? Bro. Peggy 16. Dr. William Curie's marvelous cure all tonic is an important part of any healthy hero's daily diet. It has proven to alleviate almost all known ailments that regularly affect our frontline heroes, such as swollen feet, <laughs> toothache, your face, <laughs> oh come on man this content's fucking sick the world love it and can attest to its amazing therapeutic effect but it's vitally important to only consume the prescribed wait we had they had, they had blue health potions back then back then they had, they had blue health potions man mmm the amount of tonics as extreme overuse can have some undesirable side effects such as upset stomach, blindness, loss of hair, loss of gain of appetite, dizziness, mood swings, spontaneous combustion, and in some rare cases, mutation. Oh shit. Or any of your fellow heroes display any of these symptoms. Consider calling your doctor or the nearest handy angry mom. Dude. Use your tonics responsibly, heroes, and look out for those who did it. Oh bro. Come on, you can't tell me this isn't fucking sick, man. I'd be so down for this shit. I'm gonna download this and mess around with it. Yeah, me too, man. Me too. Me too. Come on, you can't tell me that this is not fucking. This game isn't ready, man. Battlefield Heroes would be a fantastic competitor to Fortnite. Bring it out, dude. Bring it out and then fucking. Let's go. Let's fucking go, man. EA, you want you want to fucking make some money right now? Do this. Do this. 100. percent They even did like wacky helicopters too, didn't they? At one stage. And aliens too? And robots? They had a whole bunch of theme shit, man. What the hell? Why why are we like living in this stone age of like Peggy 16? Crazy, crazy. Oh, I'm loving these, man. <laughs> I'm gonna lie, that's probably BJ, bro. Dusty on main, bro. They need to advertise it way better, dude. They don't have to advertise better. I'll fucking do it for free, bro. See, and they did like their own little machinima stuff. Oh, please give me this game back. Give it back to me, man. It looks like TF2, but it played like Battlefield. It's basically Fortnite without building, man. Oh, big brain. Because he used to run in Flash, right, BJ? Flash? Or Java? Hello. Bro. Huh? They did, like, timed events and stuff. Bro. 
Unity or whatever. Battlefield 2 ran on. Really? Back then it was Unity. Oh shit. Dude. theme song but this game would slap imagine if this would look super clean 2021 get rid of all these weird sprite based stuff for the foliage even today even with this type of thing it looked cool man browser based battlefield 2 yeah 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 battlefield uh paper free and hero essentially browser based but if it's browser based it means anyone can fucking play it dude I say I've shot a Fortnite, right? I'm, I've shot a fucking Roblox. It's a client, but it's very light. And you just load in as you go to the servers. Why isn't this a game? Why isn't this a game? I'd rather play this fucking game, man. Than play uh, a lot of the other stuff that's coming out. I mean, if this came out, I'd play this over fucking CS. You know what I'm saying? This game is fucking pretty fucking cool. And they did community stuff too, man. Are you fucking serious, bro? Oh, dude. Battlefield 3 celebration. Victory Village. Uh, Trailers Extended. Market Research Movie. Vampires vs. Werewolves. Bro, they did the lot. They did the entire lot. Oh, wow, dude. 4x3. Give it a season pass challenges and it's a better Fortnite. I don't, I don't see why we're not, why, why, why this isn't even, even a conversation. This is just a definite, just go for it. The cartoony to style of stuff is fucking awesome, man. Bro. Download it on your phone, download it on your Switch, download it on your friggin' Steam Deck, download it on your friggin' consoles. But EA is looking in the wrong direction, bro. They're putting money into a big AAA title when they've they already made it. They already made the perfect title for this shit, right? Years ago, made this years ago. This game is also good looking for a 2009 game, dude. It's 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 amazing looking for a fucking 2021 game, man. Gameplay over graphics every fucking day, every day, and then you pump that in with like today's like type of shit. And if you make it sort of low enough. Bro, you could take over a lot of markets with something that, that is relatively bare bones as a game. I'd play it. Play the fuck out of it, dude. I wouldn't you? You know? Fuck. Oh my god, I'm so fucking just like, god fucking damn it, dude. God fucking damn it. Why, why, why? Yeah, you got, you got a good thing, man. You got a good fucking thing ready to go in the can. Just, just pump it out. Just do it. It's easy.